Well, Laurie, uh, first 45 minutes of football for a very, very long time. How, how good was it to be back out there today? Yeah, really nice. A little, little bit strange, but it was uh, it's good to get back on the pitch and, and sort of really start putting into practice everything we've been doing over the last three weeks of training. Um, you know, the gaff has been, you know, hell-bent on what he wants to happen. Um, so it's nice to actually put it into practice against a good team, um, which, you know, always makes it better when it's a real competitive game. Like I said, I mean, you know, there's nothing like a football match. Um, you can do all the training you want. I think particularly for goalkeepers probably to, to actually get back into a match and, and get your angles and, and, and see everything, you know, in real time. Um, you, you can't replicate it in training, can you? No, there's, there's only so much you can do um, during training. And obviously Dino works as hard as he possibly can to, to make that possible. Um, he replicates as much as possible. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, you, you're right in what you say. You can't beat a game. Uh, it's all real time, it's quick, ball's moving, especially when you're playing on a wet surface like today as well. New balls, which which made it even more exciting. But no, it's all part of it. It's just, like I say, it's just real nice to get back out there and, uh, you know, put it all into practice, all the playing, all the movements, you know, little things that you don't think about. Even, like you say, the positionings, you know, when you're moving back so quick, you've then got to set quick and, yeah, it's, it's just real nice to be able to put it into practice. Especially nice to, to make a few saves like you had to do and, uh, and get a feel for that. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's always it's always nice to make a few saves, but on the flip side, you want to have a quiet game, really. Um, but yeah, no, a couple of good saves. Obviously, their goal is one of them things that, you know, kind of the geezer really should score the first one. But, you know, he's kind of hit it straight at me. But the second one's just fallen straight to their player. But, you know, it is what it is. It's early days and, you know, there's, there's real a lot of positives to take from it. So... You've been around place for a long time, um, you know, on the books for the last couple of years, and uh, you know you, you got used to the way that you know the team wants to play, always wants to play out from the back, especially under us, and, uh, and a chance to do that again today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's been completely different from where I've come from in non-league, where it's all very direct. Um, so when I first come in. Obviously, it was it was under tears, but then Russ come in and made another change, and it was you know total football, um, and it's a real nice way to play. Um, it was it was tough for me to get used to it to start with because there's only a certain degree that you play in non-league, which is very very rare. Um, but yeah, no, it's starting to get the hang of it, and it's when it when it comes off, it's a real nice style of play, and, it, and it's real tough to play against. Um, but no, it's enjoyable as well, and starting to really settle in with it, which is nice. And you had um, a good view of both of Tally's goals. I mean, that was, it was something else, wasn't it, from, from from the young lads? I mean, I loved the first one. He just he was so casual with it. He didn't even break his stride. He just flicked it up and, you know, almost effortlessly just volleyed it, which was, you know, real good. And it's nice to see a young lad like him doing so well already. Um, he's been training well. He's a strong player. Um, and he's got all the attributes to be a real good player as well as you can see today with the, both the finishes even the second one I think for me was even better than the first because he's falling away from goal getting pulled all over the place by the centre half and you know he's buried it in the top corner so fair play to him great great finish both of them well you know there's a number of good performances I know I've just you know singled out Tally because he got the goals but there was a lot of you know a lot of young players in that team and a lot of good performances confident against a, a Cambridge side that had a lot of you know senior pros in that side yeah definitely I mean all the young lads that were in there today I mean John Tom Rowley Josh they're all superb um, you know and they're again they're learning in their trade they're learning how to you know do what Russ wants them to do um, but again they're picking it up quick and they've been very very good in training um, asking questions of all the senior boys and you know really trying to develop themselves and it was a great stage from today to really go and put that into practice and I think every single one of them can come off with their head held high you know they all just look really casual on the ball and really relaxed which is nice which is what Russ wants he doesn't want panic people panicking on the ball um, you know so fair play to all of them for coming in and making an impact as well. First chance we've had to catch up with you since uh, you signed your new deal to, to return to the football club. How pleased are you to be able to continue here? Yeah, made up, made up. Um, you know, it was it was the dream come true to come back to the club where it all started for me when I first came back last year. Um, but to, for Russ to show a bit of faith in me and keep me on again for another year is, you know, real nice. And it just, you know, I'm going to repay the favour by, you know, doing all I can to help the team this year and push and obviously be, be a good, strong part of the goalkeeping unit and help push as much as I can. Um, but yeah, it's just nice to be, you know, for a manager to show a bit of faith in you and, and you know, really tell you that he wants you and, and get a deal over the line for you.